Previously on part 3 of The Walking Dead with Wilboski. We had a fight with Lily, we had a fight with Larry. Clem still likes us, Kenny still likes us, Carly wants us in bed. But all that is going to change. I had an epiphany after part 3 that, you know what, if I'm going to be an ass through this whole game, I have to stick to it. Carly, I want to sleep with you, but it's going to be forced and mean and angry. And, and Ke Kenny, I'm done with you. And Clem, no energy bars. I'm sorry. What can you do? Um, you know, we'll find someone else for you. So let's get back to playing. The first thing you want to do here is you want to look left. And you want to get this pillow here that doesn't really look like a pillow. That is a hard pillow. Good That's what she said. That's not really what I have in mind. Alright, so after that, if you look up, you can, but you only got about five seconds. If that guy looks at you, then you're dead. So we got that one right there. Close. You know, it's kind of like the movie, uh, The Ring. <laughs> Alright, so you want to go over to the truck. Hey, zombie, what's up? We'll see you in a bit. Alright, so then you want to actually look at that zombie. And you want to push X or down and use the pillow on him. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Oh, how you doing? Nothing happening. Shoot, shoot. Yeah. That was sick. It was sick. But Glenn, I told you to shh. Keep it down. So next thing you you can do this right now just to get over with. You want to go into the car right there, and you want to get the spark plug. Why the spark plug would be right there, I don't know. And then you just want to put it in neutral. It's a uh, spark Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Come in. Handy. A lot of foreshadowing. Alright, so now you want to go back to the truck. And you want to push up so you can look in the van. And we got to get that screwdriver. So you're going to hit... You can hit the down or the X and use your... Oh! I don't feel good. <laughs> Let's see those ninja rocks. Ninja what? Up that spark plug to shatter that window, right? What the hell are you talking about? Let me see the spark plug. Yeah, see, he'll do it for you. The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. We have to keep it down, though. Glenn is whispering, so we have to, too. Alright, so you want to push over to the right. Bam! Glass broke. <laughs> Don't worry, zombies. Nothing to see here. And we got our weapon. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Oh, well, I was thinking that, or we could use it to like get some of these tires or get some other parts where we might need it. <laughs> All right, so you basically go right back like deja vu to where we were. And then you push up and you want to quickly push down so that that guy doesn't see you. And right in the head before turn. See ya. Hey Glenn, don't worry, I'll do all the work, okay? So you want to push X and as he gets closer, once this gets orange, you want to push X so that you can hit him. And then you gotta hit him again because he misses that. So now as you can see we're back at the car. We don't have to do any of that stuff. We can just push it into uh Tubbo Zombie. Don't worry, but there's nothing coming from behind. It's nothing like a big car or something. Oh Sabbath! Awesome. <laughs> hey 
bud. How are you? Oh, you can't get me. Oh, maybe uh Nope. There, I want to introduce you to my friend, Screwdriver. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice mix sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Don't give me any lip, Carly. I have an axe now. Two more. That should help. I wasn't talking about the zombies, I was talking about you guys. <laughs> okay, I'll get them first. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Too bad it's not free roam, you could just go through all the woods just hitting people with this axe. Don't worry, shh, don't worry, I'm just coming up on you, I just need to kill you. See, you gotta wait until you can push the X button. And then, see ya! Hey, you like your head? Oh, now it's gone! Bam. Alright, now time to break in. Alright, so you want to knock on the door and try to open it. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. No, Glenn needs if you open to. Up, we can take you somewhere safe. Needs to We've got help himself to you. No, no, no. She's in trouble. <laughs> Miss, we're coming in. We're coming in by force. Firefighters. Stop! Just stop! I'm coming out. <laughs> Finally. Been waiting for that. <laughs> You're hurt. Oh, no. I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys. She's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! If you have sex I with her, leave. would you get the disease that way? <laughs> you could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. That sounds pretty good to me. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. So Please you're go. Christian? Oh, well, we're Greek Orthodox, so. What if you turn and follow us back to our group? I know that was why I was locked away. Well, why didn't you say that before? What happened to me, bitch? You have a gun. Yes, so Captain Obvious. Borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Please, I no don't way. want to be one of them. They're they're satanic. I am not wasting a bullet on you. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me. Shut we up. Need to get going. Give it to me, please. This is crazy. Please step back. It's just two seconds. Just get away. Time. I'll hit, use my axe. Be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Yes. Back up, please. Damn it. Look at what you've done, you little jerk! Oh no, my gun! Actually, it's Carly's, but I'm gonna take it. Whoa, take it easy. I just wanna help. You can't. Don't do it. I, or actually, you know what? Do it! I need my gun back. You need do to it. think this through. Do it! We'll find you a doctor. It'll do it! Okay. Yes! Come on! All just... No! No! no. Yeah. yeah! Got my comeback. Hashtag awkward death. <laughs> Brian, come on. It's the apocalypse. I'm sure you've seen it before. Let's get out of here. 
figure if I'm gonna be an ass in the game, I might as well be one in real life too. <laughs> Here they come! Get in! Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine, and well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your. I don't like your shirt, like Glenn. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out of here. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. As you notice, I still have not given Doc or Kenny anyone a energy bar, so... <laughs> and, and again, just to remind everyone, Duck is not Duck to me. His name is Jerk or Jerky. Alright, so now we gotta get in. Which, now, when you're back here, you can talk to Glenn, I'll give, uh, it, uh, more information, but since we're an ass, we don't want to know anything about anyone. So, Doug, how are you? How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? That's all you're good for, yes. Let's have a look around. Okay. No, it's Will. Why is everyone calling us Jesus? There's a zombie party out in the streets. Raise the roof! He just... I'm gonna be sick just looking at your face, Doug. And if one gets you... They eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck... Nerd alert! I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. I guess I can't really say much about him being a nerd because I have glasses on and I look like a nerd, so... <laughs> Alright, so what you want to do here is you want to point the remote over here. And then Nerdy will tell us that he can do something with it. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. It's just I don't need to it. know the whole process, nerdy. You just do just it. Just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Loser! <laughs> well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might say. Ah, <laughs> see, even Lee agrees. Sam He's a dork. Alright, so Doug was also wrong. See, they eat the and they like to see uh, TVs. But not enough. Alright, so when I first played, actually, this is where I was cut, didn't really know what to do. But So, you want to go up here. And you want to use the axe, so push O to hey, crush man, this. Do we? we can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Oh yeah, we got to show him the picture because that's our brother right over there. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? Because he's my brother. I found this in the office. And he owes me money. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. You just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Didn't you see me with an axe just a minute ago? Seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Yeah, so, okay, now you can use the axe there. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Alright, so now you want to go Careful. up here again because you need to open it. Then you want to use this brick right here and pick it up. Then you're going to throw it into the sail. The sails are crashing down. 
<laughs> oh, now all the zombies are loving it, Mickey D style. Their favorite show is on the Snow Channel. Alright, so now we can run over to our brother. Don't worry, Doug, I'll take care of it. You stay here. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? What are you looking at, bro? Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to Mom and Dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. I'm going to assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Shut up, Doug. Give me a second. Listen, I hate to have to finish it off, but... This now, man. I got to do this. You did beat me in basketball that last game, and I... And you cheated, and... Let's just call this payback. I'm getting more pleasure out of this than you. <laughs> oh! Whoa! Just die! I won that game fair and square! I have a lot of anger built up. Mom and Dad always gave you more attention. <laughs> Alright, so now he's dead, so we're just gonna reach in and grab some keys. There they there are. Go. Don't worry, Doug. I got him. You didn't have to do anything. Holy crap! Run! Why are you yelling, Doug? Come on! <laughs> don't worry. You don't have to lock it. Idiot. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. No thanks to you, Doug. Getting there, Doug. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. I'm also amazing in bed. Let's get in there. I feel like you owe me, Lily. So, now or later? Okay, fine, later. We'll go in first. Damn it, Lee! Oh, no. Shit. We gotta hurry. Da na 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 na. That's from Super Mario. <laughs> da na 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 na. Oh, you are ugly. You look like someone who was not invited to a party. Oh, it looks like someone stabbed you in the back. Literally. <laughs> Look like that guy in the, uh, you know, muscle uh, pain, uh, pain commercials <laughs> where you take it out and then he's like all limber. <laughs> Zombies love drugs. It's known. Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Everyone, calm I'm down. Just grab all the energy bars you can. Hell out of the door behind me, Glenn. When you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You, got you don't need to yell. We're right Lee, here. Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into. What am I gonna to use then? My truck. Here you go. I that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three. Uh oh, Spaghettios. Back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Glenn's gotta go. We gotta get in there. Hey, Lee. We don't make it You're not gonna make it through, Doug. I think you're a great guy. 
Shut up, Doug. Shut up, Doug. Doug, if we don't make it through Don't this, say it. I want you, Carly. I should know what? Huh? That you're a nerd. I know <laughs> Are you sure? Shit. Nice shot. Okay, then. Can you look for something? Come on, be useful, Clem. For once. Okay. Hurry! Sacrifice yourself, Doug, if uh, if you can. <laughs> no, not my dad's stick. Uh, well, you know what? Yeah, he used to hit me with it, so I, I bad memories. Doug, how'd you get turned around? Come on, you're useless. Carly, the guy has one arm. Ah, oh, I want both of them to just get killed. <laughs> Clem, what should I do? Sorry, nerd. I actually have a chance with Carly. <laughs> Even though she did need help with a person with one arm. <laughs> Sorry, Doug! Oh my god. Let's go! They got done. Ah! Now, see, you have to get this uh, zombie, or else it will be game over and you'll have to redo it. No one will save Clem. Uh, it's only you. Alright, Clem, get out. Now you run towards the door. I hate this guy. My mom is a saint. She's not a bitch. How dare you. No, Kenny, what's me? Ooh, that was close. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Especially. Uh, well, only a good friend for one episode, Kenny. Next episode, I'm gonna make you hate me. Like next episode, not like Dr. Dre style, like real. Motel. Ew. Must be a cheap motel. Oh. Oh, they're suicide -y. Right there with all the other zombies. Clem, you've seen it before. You're fine. Oh, I can hear Duck already. I don't like him. Damn it. He should rip his brother out, and then it's just his parents. <laughs> Alright, so now you have to talk to Glenn first. Hey, Glenn. Whoa, don't do that. When I want to talk to you, you talk to me. Atlanta, stage nine catastrophe. Augusta, stage I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got you friends. don't have friends. Stop I lying. Just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Lily, I got this. Get away. Meh. Um, well, you know what, Glenn? Best of luck. If, if I had to make a prediction on what's going to happen to you, I have a feeling you're going to end up in a TV show. <laughs> I still think it's the wrong call because I want I need you around for the comic. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. 
Yeah, it's your fault that what happened to suicide -y. You jerk. <laughs> I think I might be saying jerk too much. <laughs> he should have checked the back of this trunk of that pizza car. Maybe left us something. Shit happens on the back of the truck. <laughs> Alright, so now you want to talk to Kenny over here. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I said you wanted kids once. Uh, I did, yeah. Well, she's not your daughter, so you can't treat her like she is. Yeah, I know that. But you can take care of her. Hell, maybe better than a father even could. Who do you think you are? Shut up. I got your back, pal. Good, but I'm about to stab you in it next episode. <laughs> oh my god, can you hear Duck? Oh, I just... I wish it would have been Duck and not Doug. So now you come talk to Carly. How you doing, Carly? You owe me. I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so happened pretty fast I know it's stupid we just met and he was such a dork it's just that I think that I liked him seriously I saved you I'm not even saying anything because I'm just mad now anyway I'd rather be alone I think oh you won't be alone later on tonight <laughs> wait Lee what is it how did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Because you're hotter. Uh, no, I didn't choose. I didn't. Ah. Sometimes we don't make choices. We just do what we do. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Well, I set it up so that he wouldn't, so I could have you to myself. But I still don't like it. <laughs> Oh, now we can... Oh, okay, we gotta save Clem from Duck. Get away, Duck. God. What are you looking at, jerk? What's my jerk count at? 25? Hey, Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. Alright, this is where we start our meanness to Clem. Not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. Because I had to be. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. It's just a walkie-talkie. Come on. It's just a walkie-talkie. It probably wasn't much use to begin with. It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. <laughs> That's a shame. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Oh, now we gotta talk to this guy. Deal with this. Oh, man, Clementine. Oh, I'm sorry, Clem, you're with Duck again. What do you want? You like my daughter? In a sexual way, that's it. Not really. Good. Stay away from her. Where everyone here knows that Lee Everett is a killer. And I'm not talking about those things out there. You hear me? I hear ya, but I'll kill you! I ask you a question, boy. Then again, I wouldn't expect a convicted murderer to listen to anything anybody's got to say. Uh, I know who can you we are. punch him? And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Yeah, well, I'll make sure I'm sitting down then so you can't get to it. Hey, Lee? Do you have a second? Yeah, I'm gonna hit on her now because you're an idiot. And you're ugly. <laughs> My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. I wish he was. Doug is dead Larry. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I'm like Superman. I'm more than one man. We're lucky to have you. You'll learn that tonight. <laughs> I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. 
This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree. I don't like the plan. Me too. Oh, we got I guess beds, we do. We got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Oh, oh, there goes the light. Talk about your all-time backfire. <laughs> <laughs> to be continued. Next time on The Walking Dead. Clum's playing by herself. If we survived the walkers, never expected they'd stop us out. I want you to have Oh, energy bar, yes! Or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry. Stop complaining. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy! I'm Andrew St. John. Bam! Shoot him right in the head. <laughs> St. John Dairy. That's beautiful. Don't repeat what happened with the walkers at Herschel's farm. You choose the kids this time. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The walkers don't worry me as much as Oh, what's with all the swearing? Who's that guy? Nice sniper rifle. Oh, <laughs> he's not feeling good. Shut up. Who are you? No more, please. Do it, Lee. No more, more, more. Get him. Yes, yes. Ah. Uh, I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm just playing one during this video. <laughs> Alright, 63% of us were honest with Herschel. Oh, uh, we were in the minority and we chose Sean. Of course I'm not going to choose Duck. Uh, we defended Kenny. Well, I mean, both were bad because I don't like either of them. Kenny, I'm, I'll stab in the back next episode. Gave Irene the gun, no. Suicide, he didn't deserve it. And of course, Carly, because Nerd Alert didn't, probably wouldn't even have done anything. Alright, that's the end of uh, episode one. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll put up uh, episode two coming up soon. Thanks again for watching. Hit that like button.